And so, um, how how do you? Because we've been talking for a while. How do you introduce this concept to people just in passing? Like, what do you say to them? I'm really curious. I mean, it's probably one of the challenges that we have in this company is that we, we don't want to be in Amazon. We don't want to be in Whole Foods. We want to make sure that the health message gets communicated. So we're doing that through doctors and nutritionalists who've got that story to tell. Um, but it isn't, uh, there isn't really an elevator pitch apart from coffee is really <laughs> good hard. for you. Yeah, yeah, and it can be made better. I mean, our argument is, you know, the taste will speak for itself. People will love the coffee, yes, but, yes. but I, I think people need to understand that it's more than that. And it's probably one yeah. of the best things that you can be drinking. And the other thing that's important, it's a very high leverage point. When you've got 164 million Americans who are gonna wake up this morning and drink coffee, that's something that everybody is doing. And if you could just even improve that behavior by 10%, it's gonna have a real impact on overall health. Um, yeah, so. and overall health, decreasing their toxic load and you know, replacing with something that's, that's, that's fabulous. 